Here in the chaplain center is the Gallery of Remembrance, a room dedicated to those chaplains who lost their lives in the service of their country. The men whose pictures line the walls have brought honor to the chaplain corps, to the army, and to themselves and their beliefs. Perhaps one painting here expresses the sacrifice that each has made. How do you do, John? How do you do, sir? I see you're looking at our Hall of Remembrance. Yes, sir. Sir, what is the significance of this painting? Well, this painting is a copy of the painting commemorating the sinking of the Dorchester in the North Atlantic in World War II when four of our chaplains, one Catholic priest, two Protestant chaplains, and one Jewish chaplain, gave their life belt to enlisted men on board the ship. And of course, they went down with the ship. It also is a copy of the picture that was used in the making of a commemorative postage stamp honoring the chaplaincy in the armed forces. And who are the men in this book, sir? This book is, carries, has in it the picture of every chaplain since World War I and World War II and Korea who have either been killed in action or have uh, died as a result of the wounds of the enemy. These are the men and their pictures also on the wall who have paid the supreme sacrifice for our country as chaplains serving in the ministry to men in the armed forces. Varied as their beliefs may be, these men, chaplains in the United States Army, are joined together in their complete devotion to God and country.